Hellbat Studios here. So as you can see, McFarlane's new summer showcase day was DC Retro. So you're probably thinking, I thought they already released some of these. Yeah, they did. They're actually re-releasing a lot of these characters. Like as you can see, the Batman, Robin, this Batmobile, and then this villain layer. I'm not sure if it's a re-release or not because it said it came out 2022 on their website. But I'm not sure because they just put it out and it didn't say re-releasing. So then from here to the Joker to this robot Batman are all new characters that actually look... They look pretty cool. Like, I like this Joker and then this Lord Death Man. I love how it says Lord Death Man. I mean, imagine Lord Death. That sounds kind of intimidating. Then Lord Death Man. Like, okay. Uh, so this robot Batman actually looks pretty cool too. So the first thing we got here is the Superman. Now, it says that these guys are from the comic. So I'm not sure if there was a comic that came out. I haven't done a lot of research into this. This is before my time. Uh, I've kind of I've watched some of the um, old episodes though, and I just I don't remember Superman ever being in there unless I missed that one. But apparently, it said these guys are from the nineteen Batman nineteen sixty six comic, so a lot of these guys may not have actually been in the movies or or show, and they just appeared in the comic. I love this Joker. I hope McFarlane does a version of this where it's like a bigger version. It's kind of, it reminds me of the Injustice skin where he's got like those, the Batman mask on and the ears are kind of bent and messed up. I'd love to see something like that from a, uh, from DC Multiverse 7 inch line or even DC Direct, but I think DC Multiverse is higher quality. So this guy looks pretty cool. Comes with some cool effects and stuff too. They all come with the little bang, pow, whack, all that junk. So then we got Lord Death Man with his katana. Thought he would have come with a sickle, but I don't know. I don't really know a lot about these guys. So so one thing that does bother me a little bit is how they don't have... The only things that I would say about these figures is they don't have the uh, bicep swivel and then like their hip joints. They can't go out. Like they can move back and forth, but they can't go out. That's just a little annoying. That would... um If those two things... I get it's a smaller figure, six inch and everything. But if they had those two joints and stuff that would probably actually push me over the edge to get in some of these things because i remember the bane that mcfarlane made he doesn't have a bicep swivel and it's really annoying i really like how this batman looks he looks it's like cartoony goofy but it also looks like cool you know what i mean i have no idea what this guy did in this show so i might sound a little ignorant about this i'm kind of just rambling on here so now this is the last thing that they've got uh all of these will be up for pre-order in the description not sure if some of them are exclusives if they are i will do that but you should go use my amazon links if you purchase these it'll help me out and that'll be great also big survey thing announcing this in every single video go check the description you'll see the survey all it wants you to do is answer what your top three most wanted dc multiverse figures are go answer that and I will use it in an upcoming video. So yeah, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed and have a good rest of your day.